My name's Keith Ketcherside. I'm the project manager for Westar on the SCR construction project. So what we're using this large crane for is uh, to erect all the uh, structural steel to actually set the SCR and all the ductwork associated with the SCR on. Right now we're building all the, uh, the structure on the ground and then we'll lift large trusses up so we minimize how much work we have to do uh, at elevation. Iron workers are working in the blind, so they're talking to the operator over radio, and you're talking about things that weigh, say, 100 tons, having to fly it into position, and a guy has to actually reach out by hand and grab a hold of it and swing it into, into position while another guy is on the radio telling the crane operator what to do. These guys we got here have done a really, really good job, very professional at what they do. Pretty much everything we do is a as a team effort basically with all the guys on the ground, the guys in the air. And of course, a machine like that, it takes two operators to run it. I'll operate one day, Scott operates the next, so we, you know, it, we've got a pretty good system like that. And my first equipment that I was ever around as a child was uh, around my father, a, a West Star retiree, as a matter of fact. We'd go out on storm damage. Uh, my mother would bring me out there to see what was going on, and you would see a lot of the old-fashioned cranes. I've been fascinated with the lifting business all my life. I like the cranes. I find it interesting. I mean, it's enjoyable for me, you know. I mean, I've, I've been doing it for quite a while and it's just, uh, I, I actually enjoy my job. Very comforting to know that I've done something that my father had part of at one point in his career. Of course, anytime a large construction project comes into a, a workplace like this, it disrupts uh, the normal flow that the, the people that have to work there every day have. And so, you know, we're trying to work together to uh, minimize that impact. So far, you know, from our perspective, the plants work very well with us. When you can see the job going in the direction that you want, everybody's taking it to heart, and it's just a good feeling overall. When you're finished with the project and you come back years later and everything is still up and running and things are going smoothly, it's extremely gratifying. Yeah, it, it, I just love it. <laughs> When you build something very large at a plant like this, serves a lot of people, it just makes you feel like you're building America. It's, uh, it's a very good feeling when you're done. Uh, and we'll, uh, we'll bask in that glory once this project's over.